Hi dad, it's Kennedy. I am making you this video because I chose you as my personal hero. You are my personal hero for many reasons. Not only are you my biggest role model, my biggest supporter, but you're also my very best friend. Um, and I'm so grateful for you and all that you do for our family um, and just how you lead our family closer to Christ every single day and how um, you've inspired me to have an authentic, genuine, and true walk with the Lord in my life. Um, I think we're both similar in so many ways. We're both very driven and motivated um, and we wanna be the best versions of ourselves. Um, and yeah, I love you so much and I hope you enjoy and thank you for everything that you've done for me. I wrote you a poem and it's called Dad. You are from Sunday mornings at Shawnee Heights Baptist Church. Grandma's fried chicken, mashed potatoes, and chocolate pie. You dreamed of country music and hit records, Nashville's next great artist. You want to be a great dad and husband, a leader for our family. You hope to be remembered for your faith, living a life that honors God, a bold witness for Christ. You remember hill sprints and 200 repeats, watching me take off like an airplane from the blocks, flying down the track. You fear the lack of truth and purpose in our world, massed in confusion, hearts turned from the Lord. You've given me laughter, hope for my future, one day marrying a man like you. I wish I could give you the mountains, Eli swimming in the Big Thompson River, a perfect day. Next, I asked you about what you would do if you had unlimited time to spend doing just one activity, and this is what you said. If I had an unlimited time to do whatever I wanted to do, it would be probably a family golf cart ride <laughs> with my <laughs> daughter, my wife, and our two dogs. And we could just do it at all the time, wherever we wanted to go. That's our favorite time to spend with one another. Um, I love this quote and your answer to this question because it's not at all what I expected you to say, yet at the same time, it perfectly encapsulates your personality and just who you are as a person. Um, I love this quote because it just shows how much your family means to you and how important we are to you. And that's um, obviously so sweet for me to hear. And I love that time that we get to spend together as a family, listen to our country music um, and driving the dogs around in the golf cart. I hope to be remembered for my uh, faith in Jesus as my Savior, that I lived a life that, that honored Him, that people saw me as someone that was not ashamed of my faith, that I was, that I was a bold witness pointing people towards the need for uh, God in our life. And I was a great dad and a great husband uh, for, my, for my family. And I was a trustworthy, hardworking uh, employee uh, in my jobs. I love your answer to this question because I think that is absolutely who you are as a person and what you will be remembered for. I feel like I'm someone who knows you better than most people in the world and that is exactly what I see in you um, and it's so encouraging to hear that and just how you're pursuing your life and living it in that way and I think you're doing an incredible job in doing so and I think you'll definitely be remembered for that. Our relationship has impacted me from the standpoint it's made me uh, softer in terms of my words, how I try to handle situations. Uh, it's loosened me up in terms of having fun, uh, trying to find a place to have fun every day. Uh, it's impacted me to uh, my faith has grown tremendously, knowing that I have a daughter in my home that's looking up to me, that's seeing what's important to me, how I lead my family, and giving her an example of hopefully one day what she's looking for in a husband. This is probably my favorite answer from your entire interview um, because our relationship is so special to me. Um, and it's so sweet and encouraging to hear you say the same. And at the end, you said how um, you hope that to be an example and that I'll one day marry a man like you and that is exactly 
um, what I want for my husband to be one day, um, a man who is grounded and rooted in his faith and loves his family in the same way that you do and is hardworking and driven um, and just a joyful and fun person like you are. So thank you. For your gift, I made you a mug. I worked very long and very hard on this, so I really hope you enjoy it. Um, I wanted to give you something that I knew you would not only appreciate, enjoy, but that you would actually also be able to use. And you are the biggest coffee drinker I know and the reason behind um, my own coffee addiction. So I wanted to give you a mug. Um, and the mug symbolizes uh, many different things. The first thing um, that it symbolizes um, is your selflessness through the mug itself um, and the way that you'll be able to pour coffee into it and enjoy it um, symbolizes just how much you've poured into me um, throughout the years um, and really just how you've shaped me um, into both the person and the athlete that I am today um, from all those times we spent together um, running the hill, doing sled pushes, um, all of those long workouts and just all of the fun memories and things we've shared together. Um, so yeah, that's the first thing the mug symbolizes. Um, the next thing symbolized through the mug um, is the mountains itself. I'll give you a little 360. Um, the next thing symbolized is the mountains and um, these symbolize your faith. Um, because we both talked about, um, one, how much we love the mountains and how much that means to us. Um, but also, two, we both feel closest um, to God and our relationship with him out in creation and experiencing that, um, especially in the mountains in Estes Park, Colorado, our favorite place on earth. Um, so I wanted to give you something to remind you, one, not of, of Estes Park, our favorite place, but also to um, about your faith because like I said earlier in the video, um, you truly inspired such um, an authentic and genuine walk with the Lord in my life um, through the way that you pursue him every day in your own. And the last thing I wanna symbolize through the mug um, with the use of the color blue in the sky um, on the inside and in the handle um, is how dependable you are and just how you're always there for me. And the color blue um, symbolizes trust and peace and reliability. And those are all things um, that you are for me. And even though you have to travel all the time for your work, I genuinely cannot think of a dad who is more present and involved in his daughter's life than you. Um, and I truly could not be more grateful for our relationship and just how you're always there for me to encourage me um, in my future and with my walk with the Lord and just how much you love mom and I. And yes, I'm so grateful for you and I hope you enjoy your new mug.